Hello everyone, and welcome back to Pokemon Legends Arceus. In the last episode, we adventured in the Balabaster Icelands to Al Alvalug's legacy to try to figure out how to defeat, not defeat, how to calm down Avalug. In the process, the warden for, what was it? For the, I can't, we, basically we were told we need to fly to get there, and the only person who wanted to do that is up there now because they're like, hey, I'm gonna chase me because it's fun. And I have a feeling you're gonna have to try to find them more than once. Anyway, so in between episodes, I just crafted a couple of items and healed up. Not much, I also teleported back to the camp because it's a lot closer. Figured it'd be easier to do it from there. Anyway, so just heading up here, I probably should have. Well, I don't know if I should have started closer. That's why I would normally like to rely on feedback from you guys, but right now, I am not getting any feedback because no one knows I exist. Anyway, let's head right up here and meet the warden. I don't remember her name, but it's on the menu if I wanted to check. Sabi. Warden and Gravier, that's it. Anyway, XY! <laughs> you made it all the way up here in this cold. But the question is, did you catch me or did I let myself get caught? Hmm. Oh, and one more thing. Am I even really clairvoyant? No idea. Hmm. No one but me could really know, right? Anyway, the challenge continues. The next stop to our, of our merry chase is No Point Temple. Um, but the real question is... The real question here is, am I really having fun playing with you, or am I bored? Hmm. Let's go, I, I don't know if I like this character or not. She does have her head in the clouds a lot, though. Like that one character said last episode. Anyway, now to the temple, which I'm definitely not teleporting to the Pearl Settlement to get closer to. Anyway, I'm at the Pearl Settlement. <laughs> So, I don't know where I need to go from here. Probably just follow the path. I look around this way, I guess. He's left. Well, I might have to know the trail. I Vulpix or Gab. I wonder if I go out. Vulpix. Well, Vulpix because it's a fire type. Actually, why isn't this just a place I can warp to normally? That would have made things a lot easier. Well, actually, there's an item over here, so... Let's look for it real quick, because I have a feeling it's going to be a... What's it called? The important letter things that they slide around in here. Nope, just iron chunks. Which I do need, but... I do need them, but not really that much. Anyway, here we are. Hi again! It's nice having someone new out here to play with. Safety in numbers or something like that. Anyway, here's Snow Point Temple. I've opened the front door for you. Just a little more chasing left for you to do. The snow melted off our clothes already? Well, that's fast. Anyway, but the real question here is, I'm really having fun playing with you? You've already, you've already said that. I heard what Warden Savvy said. If you have the Warden Savvy's approval to enter, then by all means do so. But be warned, those who cannot solve the puzzles, the temple, who not solve the temple's puzzles will not get very far within. I've heard the trick is to pay attention at which way the stone statues are looking. Come to think of it, I believe the statues have some sort of patterns on their chest too. Oh, here's the Reggies. This definitely won't be for post-game stuff. Oh, it's definitely going to be for post-game stuff. I'm, I don't know if I should stop being sarcastic. Oh. I've never seen those Reggies before, and I can't use my right Pokemon. Gone so long. Is that? No, it's Snowball. Okay. I thought that was empty. Oh my god. And backtrack for the Pokemon. Yes, 
Run as long as I want. This one's going to level 54. I ran some of the Yes, that goes one for. Can I use? Nope. Normal play wheel. Extra temporary. Oh god, he's okay. Okay, that's close. Now I want to use a, a great ball. And hopefully catch it. Well, it's almost guaranteed, yeah. It's almost guaranteed to catch it because of how much health it was at. Anyway, I probably should use a potion on Vulpix. And a berry. Anyway, now what? So, I should be able to just use a feather ball here. Should go for a wing ball. Get at the high level, let's go for a wing ball. Nope, did not work. Hey, anyway, what's this say? Nothing. How did you not notice me? Alright, where's my own berries? Um. Well, that worked. Story block point? No, oh, that's higher up. run, I guess. This is not where I'm supposed to go, but I want to know what's down here, because it's exploration. Okay, so I, I may have trapped myself. Actually, it doesn't know I'm here. Run past. I don't think it saw me. That's it, though. And that didn't work. Run away! There is no cover in here! I wish there wasn't stamina. Are they still following me? Okay, that's just a statue. The statue. Oh, okay, I get it. Follow the way the statues are looking. Alright, what's this about? There are three panels written to the door. Each panel has a pattern carved into it. There are faint traces of words carved in the door as well. What did the statues gaze? I'll wait because I know what it means. But it's just not exactly. Alright, let's see. Rock panel statues chest. Alright, so this way is, this one's facing this way with the uh, all same holes. Alright, so let's see, that one I'm going to go ice, I'm assuming, I don't know. Ice, rock, then, no, that's ice, that means rock, earth, and ice. Rock, ground, and ice. So I should go rock. No, wait, that's not rock, that's steel. Alright. So, steel. Rock, then ice. Press the panels. And nothing happened. And so... Yeah, that's steel. Steel rock eyes. I did that right, I think. Let's try the other way. No way, I did this wrong order. Alright, so should I just cut away? You know what? I'm gonna cut away until I find the correct order, because I'm gonna just take a bit, I guess. Oh, uh, I think I got it. I have no idea what I did, but... I, so let me look back at it. It was steel, rock, ice, I think. Ice. Let's see, the other one's ice. And that's steel... Oh. So that's rock, then. So steel... So it's what, it was what they were looking at. Okay, I got it.
Oh, hey, Wisp. Don't mind if I do. Touch. Fishing was meaning like the temple or the uh, the temple or Alabaster Icelands. I heard a zoo bat, so I need to be careful. Looks like ice last. Ice rock. Ice rock steel. And there's one over there. Ice rock steel. What was that one? Ice rock steel rock. Ice rock steel ice. Alright, so ice, rock, steel. Rock or ice? I'm gonna go rock. Wait, what? There's more? Uh, ice? Uh. Alright, I guess I got it. What's in here? Okay. Doors there. Well, there. Let's find the back one first. I looks like I'll start in here. So, steel is the last one. Alright, so ice. Rock. Ice rock, ice rock, ice, ice rock, ice steel, ice rock steel, ice rock steel, I hope. Alright, ice rock steel. Ice, rock, steel. Nope. All right, let's try this one more time. And just try again, I guess. So steel's the last one. I right, ice. Rock. Ice, rock, ice. That's where I went wrong. Ice, rock, ice. Uh, ice, rock, ice. Ice, rock. Ice, rock, ice. Steel. Ice, rock, ice, rock, steel. Ice, rock, ice, rock, steel. Steel. Ice, rock, ice, rock, and then two steel. Nope, uh, I'm gonna take a couple looks at this and try to figure it out, and I'll cut back once I figure it out. Steel, ice, rock, ice, steel, then rock. All right, I did it. I the steel one went first. I not last. I got that mixed up. Somehow got it correct the first time. I don't know how. Uh, so what's in this room? Uh, that's not good. That's an alpha Pokemon. I'm going to lure that Ralph away and try catching it. What we'll I actually have to do, uh, evolve, give it food, hypnosis to feed him, um, catch without being spotted. That works for me. Alright. One down, and I doubt I'm gonna catch you. But it's worth this. Well, what do I need to do for a delay? Nope. Well, definitely not catching you. I'm running through now. 
you and I are whole guys. That's a sensor area, it's like run. Just run. Hello. Right, looks like I got away. Just back to great balls. Okay, right here it is. Just in case. I've made it at least. I guess I've been caught, so we're nearly done. That's no fun. Hey, remember my clairvoyance? It showed me something else. I saw you flying with Braviary. Do you think they'll come to pass? Where even is Braviary? Well, however the future turns out, flying with Braviary isn't easy. If you really want to be able to fly high in the sky, prove to me you're strong enough. Pokemon battle? Gonna take us on? Yep. No idea what she's using, but I right, selected a fire type, so. No, get ready, cause here comes right after. Magmar and Electric. <laughs> All three of the Okay, so anything weak to fire. Cause Volpix might have been the wrong choice. Volpix was the wrong choice! I thought I made it to the factory. No, nothing. So I think that's Samurai. Right. Yeah, Aqua Tail. I might die for this, but. Well, we're gonna die. That's not good. The electric sound, the electric type's next. Just go off with no. You're kidding me, right? And it's an agile style move. Well, at least it's only paralyzed. Just looking around. High horsepower, yep, there goes. Oh, Sabra Dodge! Yes! No, that's cool. Flame throw animation, no. Really? How many attacks do these guys get? Uh, Grab or be effective with Aura Spear. I don't want to send Drift Minions. Sure, Gabble, because uh, Electric type. I think it's just to get Fire type, too. Yes, Thunder Wave has no effect on Gabite. Take that! And now bulldoze! Should've gone Agile style! Like that! Poison gas, better than flamethrower I guess. I can handle poison for now at least. Alright. Yep, bulldoze. Well, for a normal bulldoze, you hopefully go with my axe and see if it's going out. Oh, that took it out! Alright, Electro, that has no effect on it. Yeah, the Electro is pretty good. This, this is the handle. She had some strong Pokemon on her for what I thought she'd have. I, I expected two Pokemon at the most. This is the first time someone sent three against me at once. Is it fair? No, but I beat them. Wow, you caught us and you beat us. You won all our games so far. But Braviary still wants to know you even better. Up to the roof we go. Please don't say I have to battle Braviary. Please don't say I have to battle Braviary. Just in case I'm holding Pear Tree out, but I don't want to fight Braviary. Yeah. If we do have to fight it, we said the giant Pear Tree that I got a good chance. Oh, there's Braviary. And that's one reason why I don't try doing Pokemon impersonations. Hi, Braviary. Why not test out his strength? I'm gonna have to fight Braviary. 
Yep. There, Chew. Alright, let's see what do I have. Spark. Baby Doll Eyes Lower Attack. I'll go for Baby Doll Eyes Lower Attack. And then use the healing move. Perfect. And more defensive stats with Crunch. Maybe. Is it only gonna lose? Double it, something different. Go for the Agile style front. Take it out, and I have a spark to back it up. Alright. Start with the electric type, and don't even use an electric move. Of course. I can't believe Braviary lost. But that's that. Thanks for playing with me. Guess I'll head home now. Bye. Hey. <laughs> that's not fair. I was just kidding. Okay, good. Play along with me on your flute. Play along, not play after. Oh well. Braver was in Heartland all the time. Alright, so give me the plate. Yep, sky plate. I wonder who could have seen that coming. Thanks, Savvy. Oh, wait, Adam Man. When did you get here? Sure, having X Y fly on would should be fun for Braviary. Yeah, I'm glad. A world where people and Pokemon live and work together, huh? Tell me, why do you think the lightning that comes from the rift would cause these frenzies? Do you think this is Almighty Sinnoh's anger? Or do you think it's a trial that's putting it to us? If it's a trial, if we prove ourselves worthy, and we kill well the last noble, calm Avalog. Then the rift ought to close, right? Even if the one seems to be clearing this child is a newcomer like you, not one of us who've been living here in Asui for ages now. How come you're playing all wise? I thought you weren't a big thinker, Adamant. Hush, Savvy. I can feel history on the move. And as far as I can see, the one ushering in this new era is you. So if I stick with you, someday I might get to meet Almighty Sinnoh myself. The question is, does listening to Adamant fascinate you or bore you to tears? Anyway, it's time for you, it's, anyway, XY, it's time for you to go. Sword with Braviary. If you jump away up here, Braviary can take you going just about anywhere. But don't forget to get the Eternal Ice. That's why you needed Braviary in the first place, right? Avalog's legacy is down there. Now go get a feel for flying with Braviary. When you're done storing the skies and want to land, just ask him to dive. Now call Braviary and glide to the air then. Tutorial? Yep. With Braviary, you can fly high up in the sky and explore different areas to see from the air. You can summon Braviary by using the plus button, wherever you may be. You may also press the A button if you're falling down some height to summon them in a flash. Alright, that is definitely useful. Hold on. Drive and dash. Yeah, let's try heading to Avalanche then. Unfortunately, you still can't throw a Pokeball here. That's what the... what are they called? That's what the Feather Balls and Moon Balls are for. Let me try something. Another way to get down, I guess. I don't recommend that route, but you can. Can I not pick up this stuff here with Pokemon? Wow, I can't. Crunchy Salt. Huh? My arc phone.
Please control it. What was the arc phone beeping? A type of ice blown by the Lord of Tundra, Avalug. This ice is said to be fragments of ancient Avalug that lived long ago. Ah! Oh, how? He climbed up here. At last, the summon of this conqueror. conqueror. And I see you made it too. Flew down to this place and obtained the eternal ice, didn't you? What drives that burning zeal of yours, I wonder? You gave Garretic the eternal ice. I do have to respect the effort you put in. I may still have my own doubts weighing on my mind, but I will make the necessary preparations so that you can face my lord, Avalug. Meet me at Ice Peak Arena. Now, don't try to repeat the wondrous feat you're about to see me perform. A tall leap like this can only be managed by highly toned bodies like mine. Till we meet next. No, till next we meet. I am terrible at sayings like those. Um, anyway, so... Anyway, I'm pretty much out of time here. In the next episode, we are going to head to the Ice Peak Arena. Battle... Avalug. Ah, I can catch this guy from up here. Ah, he moved. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you all later. Bye!